Who's in control of your life? What controls your life? Your honest answer to this question could reveal either your greatness, your personal strengths, your greatest personal strengths, or maybe your greatest weaknesses in life. Because the things that you believe are going to affect the way that you live your life and the approach you have to your future. Today's January the 14th. You're watching The Daily and I hope you've liked, subscribed. I hope you've got the ebook. This whole month, we're talking about responsibility. I hope you've gone to DaveMartin.org, downloaded the ebook, Responsibility. Do you believe that your future is being manipulated by someone else, maybe the government? Do you believe that your professional pursuits are being controlled by the people with more power than you? Do you believe that your economic, the economic factors are, uh, are keeping you from achieving your financial goals? Do you believe that secretive groups of people are quietly controlling the economy, the media, the destiny of the nations? Well, obviously, a person can only control his environment to a limited extent. And obviously, a person can, well, has little or no control over the timing of their birth or the attitude and behavior of the culture in which they live. But within all those contexts, some people succeed and other people don't. Some people soar while others uh, languish in mediocrity. Ultimately, the factor that determines what a person becomes is the person's ability to see that they are the primary determining factor in the outcome of their life. In the United States, where a lot of people that are watching this live, I know we've got people in Indonesia as well. Sisa Hadutmu, Akan Menjeri, Yang Terbaik, Sisa Hadutmu. We got people all over South America and uh, Central America, Spain, El Resto de Tu Vida, Soralo Mejor de Tu Vida. Uh, of course, we've got people in Canada. The rest of your life will be the best of your life. Hey, eh? hey, wherever you're watching from, I'm so glad you're watching. But you know, here in the United States, and really a lot of places around the world, it is particularly true that an individual is the navigator of his own life. And, well, it's really true anywhere. The captain of their own destiny. Your future is controlled by you and you alone, regardless of the shifting winds of change that are blowing all around you and regardless of what Washington or Moscow or uh, wherever, um, City Hall in your town or any other entity may be doing. So I want you to reclaim the reins. We're halfway through the first month of this year. Come on, let's reclaim the reins of our life and let's chart the course for the future, for our own pursuits. Learn from the mistakes that we've made in the past maybe even already this year. You know, they say a lot of people, over 50% of people have already given up on their resolutions and we're only on the 14th of the month. You can move forward with confidence. You know what, if you already missed it, here, today is a brand new day. You can start right now. You have the ultimate control over your own destiny. Let's begin today to make some different, well, you already messed up, oh, don't worry about it. Start over today. Today's a brand new year. You can start from January the 14th to the next January the 14th and make this your best year yet. And I'm going to help you do that by joining me on The Daily. I'm making these for you. So I want to see you every morning, The Daily with Dr. Dave, just a couple minutes to help you. This month we're talking about responsibility, and it's your responsibility to go to davemartin.org and download the ebook responsibility it'll you'll get it right away and i promise you it won't take you long to read but it'll be well worth it this whole month we're talking about responsibility make sure you like follow subscribe and share this with someone else this is the daily with dr dave see you tomorrow <laughs>